Are you new to XCOM 2, but don't know exactly where to begin? Well, don't worry, we've got you covered with our beginner's guide to XCOM 2, the perfect place to start for any new players. To kick things off, I strongly advise starting on the rookie difficulty if you're brand new to the XCOM series. Don't worry about the game becoming too easy, you'll be able to adjust this difficulty at any point during the game. At the start of the game, you'll only be able to have four soldiers in combat. An early upgrade that is a necessity is to excavate a section of your ship and then have an engineer build the Guerrilla Tactics School. Once constructed, you can choose a new tactic and for only 50 supplies, build Size Squad 1, which will instantly allow you to bring a fifth soldier to battle. Once you also have that fifth squad member, I always recommend bringing one rookie to battle. This way they will have guidance of stronger soldiers around them to help them pick up their first promotion easier and if things get hairy and you need to sacrifice a soldier, the rookie can keep higher value members alive. Another early facility I recommend building next is the Proving Grounds. Here you'll be able to choose armors that will help increase the health of each soldier in battle. Start off with the Predator Armor. This is a very effective armor very early on. Once it's been researched, make sure you visit Lily to finalize its purchase and it will be equipped to all your soldiers, granting them 4 health and an extra utility item slot. At this point in the game, you may need a few more supplies or intel or even corpses. As you fly around the map, don't be too worried about supply drops that keep popping up once they are available. Stick to one and make sure you clear it all the way out before moving on to another. And at any point, if the Avatar project is currently underway, don't worry about that bar filling up all the way at the top of the screen. Once it's full, a countdown timer will begin, and you can always complete a dark event successfully, and it will turn that countdown timer back to the bar system previously. Another bit of research you'll want to do early will help your soldiers make a bigger impact in battle. Have Dr. Tygen research magnetic weapons. Upon his completion, you'll be able to visit Lily and select which weapons to unlock per class. These mag weapons will help your soldiers deal significantly more damage to enemies, and are only a first step to better weapons in the game. One last tip I have is to make sure that you have the correct utility items and attachments before you jump into battle. As you pick up attachments for your guns, make sure you're attaching them to get their bonus perks while you're in battle for those clutch moments. Also make sure you have a good mix of utility items between your troops so you're prepared for anything the enemy throws at you. Have any other helpful tips for new players? Let them know in the comments below. I'm Andrew from Curse saying thanks for watching and enjoy the game.